The story of rare, threatened, and endangered species of South Carolina. Northern cricket frog, Bachman's sparrow, green salamander, eastern red bat. Eastern wood rat, island glass lizard, santi crayfish, swamp rabbit. Eastern cougar. Cougars were eliminated from South Carolina due to loss of the forests and due to farming and hunting in order to protect the farms. Today, there are no wild populations of cougars in South Carolina. The little blue heron. Heron is threatened by habitat loss linked to climate change, sea level rise, and saltwater encroachment. Important nesting sites need to be protected. Dolphins. They're not endangered, but they are susceptible to human activity. Getting caught in fishing gear, pollution, even noise pollution, can interfere with their ability to communicate. Black swamp snake. When average yearly temperatures rise, species like snakes will need to adapt by migrating to warmer climates. Loggerhead turtle. The waters off the coast of South Carolina are host to many sea turtle species, ranging from massive loggerheads to the smallest Kemp's Ridley. Despite their tough shells, these ancient reptiles face daily battles for survival. Injured turtles that wash on shore are victims of everything, from commercial dredging and fishing hooks to sharks and stingray attacks. The South Carolina Sea Turtle Rescue Center is on constant standby, ready to rehabilitate these ancient reptiles and return them to their natural ocean habitat. Tank 1, Edisto, 30 years old, found floating with a crab trap and tangled around its flipper. Rehabilitated and released 2007. Tank 2, two juvenile Kemp Ridleys, Little Debbie and Squirt, hooked from a fishing pier. Rehabilitated and released June 2013. Tank 3, Caldwell, a 45-pound juvenile loggerhead Stranded off Hilton Head, South Carolina. Rehabilitated and released July 2017. The earth does not belong to us. We belong to the earth. What we do to the forests of the world is but a reflection of what we do to ourselves and to one another. Hold your hand over the earth as over a flame. To all who love her, she gives of her strength. For the gifts of life are the earth's, and they are given to all.